right, Libra. Let's see what's going on for you guys. Something very specific. I have trust. The situation is calling for you to have faith. You have like someone, a younger person on the other side, looking out for you, guiding you. Okay. This is, this is going to resonate for everyone. If this resonates for you, um, trust that the information that this person is bringing to you, trust that you're following it. Um, in some cases, they're they're doing things just to let you know that they're there. So pay attention to those times that you notice their energy, you notice anything about them. Just pay attention to what's happening in that moment. Um, in some cases, it's just something to bring you back into the present moment, okay? This younger person, now this could be a child, this could be a sibling, it could be a friend. Where they passed when they were younger. You could be, you could be dealing with someone in the military, someone who wears a uniform. Red is a really good color for you. Okay, so this is the soulmate, soulmate energy. I get pulled to certain things on the cards and then I just get messages. Okay, this could, person could be an Aries, could also have water in their chart. You got to check all placements though. Don't get hung up on just the sun sign. This person is, I mean, they're wealthy, they're secure, they're stable. I have the emperor and then this nine of pentacles. Like if you're doubting if this person is too good to be true, just relax. Allow this person to show you who they really are. I feel like this person may hold back a little bit and that may make you anxious. But like they've gone through their own battles, okay? So you got to allow them to get to know you, to trust you. All you can do is one, don't jump down their throat if they're not sharing things like right away, okay? But two is just show them that you're a safe space for them. You don't tell them that, that's by your behavior, okay? Fours are going to be significant for you guys. So you may be seeing four, four, four. Mm. We have a lot here. Okay. All right. Be careful. I want you to just be careful that you don't cause any chaos with this. Okay. I want you to use your intuition. You're this high priestess. This is about trusting your intuition, the information that you're receiving. Not the nervousness, not the crazy thoughts. When, when anxiety starts to kick in, not those crazy thoughts, okay? That's the ego, that's the hurt child. Go over to my YouTube channel, watch the video, learn how to tap into your intuition. You also become a human lie detector. This teaches you how to tap into your higher self, your intuitive guides, your int intuition, and how to trust it. Because it's leading you to this four of wands. I told you fours were going to be significant for you guys. Okay, that's that marriage, the commitment, okay, whatever that commitment looks like to you. Some people don't want to be married. What else do we need to know? This person may be in hermit mode or they may come in and out of hermit mode. Could also have Virgo placements. 
But it's like they have to go into this hermit mode to come back to like their self-love, get balanced, and then they could give to you. So it's like this. I became a much better parent when I started to love myself, okay? I started to show up very differently for my children, for my family, for my friends than I did when I was wounded. So you're gonna allow this person to go within when they need to tap back into that self-love so that they could give it back to you. Like they need to go and fill up their cup so that they could give it to you. All right, let's see. Any blocks? Stop thinking that you're broken. Stop thinking that you need to do something. Stop thinking that you need to fix yourself. You, you have everything that you need. You're highly intuitive. Just tap into that intuition, okay? You're getting messages, but you're rejecting them. Again, watch that video, learn how to tap into your intuition. I want you to follow that process. It's gonna help you become like crystal clear on exactly what you need to do and what you, what you shouldn't do. Follow that um, on the bridge of incidents. That's like the keys that are opening all the little doors leading you to this four of wands, this happily ever after. Ha, huh, a sorceress. You are a magical person who can manifest your clear intentions into reality. Okay? Don't overthink this. Just trust yourself. I love you guys. You got this.